update on the gym situation since the cop came and uh, knocked on my van I just wanted to switch gyms um, I decided to go to a gym that uh, is 24 hours 7 days a week and not just 4 days because the one I was going to I didn't realize it was only 4 days a week that it was 24 hours and the rest of the days it's um, different times it closed early and stuff like that and I like my freedom and when you know when I want to go to the gym I could go whenever whatever time right and I could stay as long as I want I really like that you know so I went over there last night it was I ain't gonna lie it was real good but it's so it's so crazy you know the the franchise of the gym situation they're mo most of them are set up the same way you know they got similar machines and whatnot but that gym you know I liked I liked it for certain things and I didn't like it for other things same with the, the one I'm, I'm at right now and that one had some real good machines um, it's just that the bathroom was more it was it wasn't as clean as the other one you know and as you guys can see in one of my well probably like two of my vlogs I did already when I showed the bathroom how clean it looked and that's really how it is all the time but the gym I went to last night it was dirty, sh like it was dirty. It was, uh, it was annoying. Like it was just dirty, and um, but when it came to the machines and all that, it was, it was nice. It had a lot of machines, a lot more machines, and it had a lot of machines that I like. All right. Um. So yeah, I did a nice session. You know, last night I trained chest and arms and back. And um, I was trying to work out transferring my membership, you know, but they said they didn't see me in the system. It's just a whole process now. I guess I got to go through. I got to go talk to the people, the gym that I'm, I'm a member at right now and um, try to transfer my, my membership or whatever, right? So, yeah, that was that. I uh, did a nice session last night. I left around 4 a.m. I got like probably like two, three hours of sleep. And I was back editing. I just got done editing, posting a video of when the cops knocked on my door, on my uh, my van. And uh, now I'm just vibing. Today's the Sabbath. So, you know, we got to keep it holy. And I can't buy or sell or do anything like that on uh, before um, sundown. I could do it after sundown. So, I'm um, right now. I'm just debating on what I want to eat. You know what I'm saying? So, I'm, I know I'm gonna eat some fruits, but I want to eat something solid too. So I could, um, cause right now I'm, as I'm chilling, my body's re recovering too. So, um, you know, I want to put something beneficial in my system. You know, and majority of my foods are raw foods. You know what I'm saying? I cut out all the snacks and all that. The, the most I eat when it comes to snacks, and I only eat it when I eat my wraps, is some chips. And, you know, I'm about to cut all that. Well, I won't say I want, I'm going to cut it all out, but I, I got balance. So I'll do a detox, clean out my system, you know what I'm saying? And then I'll, you know, again, eat it eventually again when I eat wraps, right? But... Yeah, so I don't know, but I've just been on this tuna wrap uh, for a while now. And I feel like I'm in the mood to eat some tonight, so I don't know. And I really want to show you guys how I make it. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, you never know. I could help somebody else who's in the van life, you know, who uh, who's new to van life. You know, because I'm kind of new to it. You know what I'm saying? But, um... Yeah, that's about it right now. And right now I'm just vibing, uh, doing some research and uh, watching some videos and stuff. And um, when I'm done, I'm going to go probably go to um, Walmart and get some uh, some wraps, spinach wraps to go with my tuna and whatnot. So, yeah, either that or some beef fatty. I don't know. I don't know if the beef fatty s store is open or whatever yet. But, uh, yeah, that's about it. So today's just a chill day vibing. 
I ain't gonna lie, I feel good today. I feel real pumped. And uh, I don't know if I'm gonna work out tonight. I might, I might. I'm in the mood too though. You know what I'm saying? I've been going nonstop, you know? And I gotta bring some more, I gotta put in some more work when it comes to my content for my, um, for my fitness page. I gotta get back on Instagram. So right now I'm just organizing in my head, you know, different, um, things to post and whatnot to get back in the you know on the, in the groove you know what i'm saying so yeah go follow me on instagram at iron addict javon just got some beef patties real quick um <sighs> now i'm about to head to walmart and um i'm about to get some spinach wraps to go with my uh to make my tuna uh wrap and um Probably just vibe for the night. Right now I'm sore as hell. My body is hurting. Uh, my gym over here isn't gonna be open. I wanted to work out, but I don't think they're gonna be open. I gotta check and see what time they close. Cause they close early on Saturdays. I think they already closed. They probably about to close at seven. I don't know, but yeah. So I'm about to head to Walmart right now, and um. Get my spinach wraps and um, my tuna and whatnot. Then I'm gonna get, I'm gonna pull up at my spot where the cop uh, knocked on my door. And I'm going to probably get a movie and watch and chill out for the night. Or I just might, according to what mood I'm in, I might just drive to the other gym that's 24 hours and is open. The one that I'm, I'm working on uh, transferring my membership to. So, I don't know. But it's like 20 minutes away. I don't feel like driving over there. And shit like that. But I might. I don't know. I'm going to see. But so far, everything ch cool. I'm just vibing right now. I hope y'all having a real good day. I hope y'all uh, doing what y'all got to do in life. To make your life uh, as 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 best as you could while you're still alive, you know, while you're still on Earth, and yeah, you know, and being a good person, you know, stuff like that. You know. But uh, yeah, and the crazy thing is, I didn't even eat all day. Actually, I, all I ate today was an apple this morning, and. Um, I normally eat once a day, you know, like you see, I will go uh, put in some work, edit, uh, you know, record videos, whatever, whatever, stuff like that, a uh, little, um, what you call it, um, errands or whatever, go to the store, stuff like that, then I'm gonna go, like I said, you know, chill out and um, now I'm gonna go eat, you know what I'm saying, I gotta feed these gains and, um, that's about it but right now to be honest even though I'm you know doing what I'm doing when it comes to eating I need to really you know uh, buckle down and do my uh, detox and you know flush out my system again because I've been eating um, a lot of tuna you know what I'm saying and uh, like I said before uh, all meat is a uh, mucus forming and it's um, inflammation, inflammatory. It forms inflammation in your in your in your in your body, which leads to damaged cells, and that leads to diseases. All right, like cancer, all that. You know what I'm saying? So every now you gotta be balanced. I wouldn't tell you guys like I said before. I'll give you. I'll look out for you guys. You know, I'll let you know what's good, what's bad, what what you should avoid when it comes to food. But I'm not going to tell you guys to cut everything out. You know what I'm saying? What I'll tell you to do is have balance. You know? Do a detox. Clean your system out. Because normally, we just live our lives and eat whatever. And we don't ever clean out those toxins in your, in our blood. You know? Before I knew what I know now, after going and uh, taking these classes and stuff for uh, natural healing and all these things, right? And, um... 
detox and whatnot, right? All these toxins was in my blood too, you know? But now, you know, things are better now because I know how to detox my system and get all these uh, mucus out of my body, you know what I'm saying? Inflammation, all these things out of my body, you know? So I don't really have to deal with no diseases. That doesn't mean that I can't get a disease, but um, the thing is, with balance, you know, I might have a better chance of living a longer life without getting any of these diseases instead of just, you know, letting it stay in my body over time. And I don't, you know, I'm just living like how I used to live and not getting any detoxes or anything like that, you know? So just like my, my grandmother and my aunts, you know, they had to deal with diseases because of uh, the same situation the food, the meat, you know, and my background is, uh, I'm Caribbean, so in the Caribbean, we eat real good, and every, most of what we eat, well, majority of our dishes, we have meat in it, you know what I'm saying, and we eat a lot of curry and all these things, right, since I was a baby, since I was young, you know, so, you know, just imagine never getting a detox, like, the whole time, you know, for those amount of years, you know, a disease will catch up with you. Something is gonna catch up with you. You know, I'm gonna look out for 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 you guys. I'm gonna help as much people as I can. You know, what I'm saying those who want to take the knowledge, take it. Those who don't, you know, that's up to you. But uh, yeah, I'm trying to live a long, healthy, balanced, you know, enjoyable life. You know, what I'm saying because all we have is uh, our energy, our health. You know, and our time, you know. Everything else is vanity and whatnot. We can't take it with us when we die, so it don't really matter. It's it's um irrelevant. I'm about to pull up at Walmart now. You know what I'm saying? Um I'll grab what I need real quick. And um yeah, then I'm gonna pull up at the other spot my chill spot and I'm gonna relax and eat and you know chill out then tomorrow I'm gonna just well God willing I'll wake up to see another day I'll see what what's up for tomorrow it's the next day <sighs> yesterday um was actually a decent day um, after I left Walmart, I, um, I came back to my chill spot where I'm at right now. Made my wraps, tuna wraps. Um, what else? Oh, and I just relaxed and watched, um, some videos and stuff like that. But I was so tired, though, from not getting much sleep, um, that I, um, I didn't realize I just knocked out right where I'm sitting in the front seat, right? And I, I was asleep until um, two two cops came again, right? And one knocked on my window this time. And uh, he was actually real cool. He was cool. He he didn't, he didn't come to see what I'm doing or anything like that. He came and he asked, um, and I was knocked out too when he knocked on the window, right? So he came. And he asked, um, he said, oh, did, did you call 911? Like, we got a call in this area from someone calling 911. I was like, nah, I didn't call 911. And he's like, all right, man, thanks. And then he just walked away, and that was it. You know what I'm saying? Normal shit, you got me? <laughs> so when I checked the time, it was like 4, 4 a.m. So I knocked out around like 10 a.m. That's the last time I looked at the time before I fell asleep. And um, sometimes when I feel like I'm, and this happens a lot, when I feel like, you know, I start drifting away and I just, you know what I'm saying? I realize, oh, I'm getting real tired. I gotta put my windows up because I fell asleep with my windows down many times. So, you know, so said, so done. I put my windows up. Before you know it, I was knocked out. Woke up around 4 a.m. when he knocked on the window, right? So I was knocked out in the front seat. <laughs> 
know what I'm saying? I woke up, I got flashlights in my face and shit. And, um, uh, yeah, that was it. I think I, uh, I just chilled for a bit after that. And, um, now it's around like, probably like after nine or 10. And I'm about to get my clothes and stuff together for me to um, shower after I take my, after I work out. I'm content, you know, I'm happy with what I have. I'm happy with the freedom, you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't think anything else would make me more happy than just freedom, you know? Just being able to live for the Most High God of Israel, you know what I'm saying? All praises to Him. It's amazing. It's a blessing, you know. Wake up to see another day today. I could go do my thing, work out, you know what I'm saying? Take my time. You know what I mean? I love that, man. I really love that, bro. Cuz at the end of the day, we going to die. So, it don't matter what you own, well, what you own on this earth, cuz you going to leave that shit right here. None of these things matter, man. You really got to use your brain. Think. That's why you got a brain. Understand that these things don't matter. It's what you do with your time matters. You know what I'm saying? Because that's, that's, that's it. You know what I'm saying? Making history. Making, uh, you know what I'm saying? Having good times. You know what I'm saying? Being a good person. Treating others the right way. Helping others. You know what I'm saying? As much as you can. So, yeah, man. I don't know what I'm going to work out yet. Um, I'm going to just go with the flow. I like to go with the flow and... Well, I go with the flow a lot of times, you know what I'm saying? That's just how I am. But um, today, for sure, I'm definitely going with the flow. I'm just chilling. If you guys want to see my last, my workout video, full workout video on how to get bigger arms, subscribe to the link in the description below, all right? I um, posted a video on my fitness page, my fitness YouTube page, and go follow me on Instagram at Iron Addict Javon. All right, I will be posting new content there very soon. So, but you know, this is my vlog channel, so you probably won't see much of this workout on here. So, yeah. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go with the flow today. I think I'm gonna definitely start off with legs though, so I could just, you know, um, gradually uh, get into the to the to the pump. You got me, and then just see how the gym is see if it's packed because on sundays it's normally packed right now i'm just getting my stuff in order got my headphones ready my phone charged up for my music got my water stay hydrated um yeah got my hoodie because i love to work out in hoodies i haven't worked out in a tank top in, in forever and i don't feel like i'm ready yet I don't feel like I'm ready yet. I'm not where I want to be yet, my body-wise. So, even though I could do it now, but, nah. But I really like working out in hoodies. I, I like to be in the zone, you know what I'm saying? Protect your energy. Don't let nobody uh, drain you of your energy by arguing or talking shit to you. Or, and you give in to that. Don't do that. All right? Your energy is very, very important. All right? Your time is very important. Your, um, you know, your, your, the life that you have is very important at the moment. So, you know, use it, use your time wisely. You know, take it serious to the point where it's not wasted. You got me. That don't, that don't take away from having fun. Always make sure you have fun, and you know what I'm saying. Make always make it fun. You know what I'm saying? Because life is short. So, just remember that. You could die anytime. So have fun, man. No matter what, have fun. Have fun. Laugh in the face of the, the devil. You got me? Laugh in the face of that. Anytime uh, situations get, get hard for you and it's tough, man, laugh in the face of that because the devil wants that for you. He want to see you doing bad. The most high God don't. You got me? So trust me, laugh. I learned. I'm 34 years old and I learned a lot growing up. You know, and I used to be real stressed out. I went through that whole life situation where when hard times hit, 
a lot of things would change around me. Like, as in, I'm not in the mood to work out anymore. I'm not in the mood to do this. I don't want to eat. I don't want to, you know what I'm saying? I didn't know how to deal with it. I didn't know that it was the devil behind it. I didn't know, you know, because of how I grew up. No one was there to tell me until I know now. So there's a lot of things that are different now. And it's amazing how I learned it. Because on the other side, after dealing with the problems and dealing with it differently now by laughing in the face of it and just continuing to trust the Most High God and that everything will be okay. At the end of it all, everything do become okay. It's so amazing, you know, but it only happened when I started trusting the Most High God. It wasn't happening when I was giving in to the devil by stressing out, stressing out from what he's doing to me. You got me? So, yeah, man, that's for you guys. A nice little tip for those who are stressing out there who's not, you know, taking advantage of the fact that they have life, you know, and not understanding that what's going on on earth is only temporary. You know, it's all going to be gone. So you might as well have fun anyway. You know what I'm saying? And the good times and the bad times, you might as well have fun. I don't mean take care of what you got to take care of. Make sure you do, but focus on the, the goal, you know, focus on the goal. Don't let nobody take your energy from you, your time from you, your shine from you, you know. But yeah, man, I hope you have a real good day. Make sure and eat a good meal today. Make sure and help whoever you could help. You know what I'm saying? And um, yeah, live fit, stay stay healthy, cause health is wealth. You know, health is all you got. Um, if you need help on any of those things, send me an email. Subscribe to my channel in the description below. All right. Um, that's about it, man. I'm, uh, much love to all of you guys uh, Don't forget to subscribe Smash the like button all right? So the channel could grow You know I could post more We could get to know each other more And help each other more You know what I'm saying Interact with each other I appreciate all the love That's here right now With my two subs with four subscribers And um, the love that's about to come Anytime you want to change your life around You know get in good shape and not just look fit, but internally you're, you're, you're healthy, all right? There's a lot of people who look healthy. There's a lot of people who can work out and all of these things, all right? But internally, they don't know what to eat. So they will eventually still get sick and all these things. I don't. I can't tell you unless I got sick, bro. I can't tell you unless I got sick. Literally, bro. That's, it's literally because of what you eat. What, what you eat. Literally. No cap, you know what I'm saying. When I when I didn't know, and I didn't go to to, to uh, online school for this, and I didn't learn what I know now, I used to get sick because I used, I didn't know what to eat. <laughs> I just knew how to work out, but now I got the whole package. You got me. So, yeah, man, I appreciate all of you guys, man. Have a real good day. I'm gonna see you guys in the next video. All right, like, comment, subscribe. Peace.